Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach. I just got done working out and it is Saturday, so it is another WW grocery haul. I went to both Walmart and Trader Joe's, found some really fun seasonal things that I'm really excited to share with you. So if you're here for another grocery haul, give it a big huge thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, I'd love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button, click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. We do grocery hauls every single Saturday. Check out the description box down below for my two recipes ebooks we have breakfast and lunch both contain 15 recipes with all ww plan points and calories included definitely get your hands on those i'll be releasing the next ebook very shortly so you'll have lots and lots of recipes on hand when you pick up all of the different ebooks you'll also find nutrition coaching where i offer personalized to you macros and calories highly highly recommend and one-on-one -on -one coaching if you want to chat with me directly links discounts to all my favorite things and my facebook group are also down in that description box so let's jump in to this week's grocery haul oh and heads up it is the final thank goodness voiceover i will be able to film as normal starting next week so i am going to up the volume so you can hear me a little bit better in the voiceover so thank you guys for the comments on that we're in my office me and the three dog right there playing away so let's jump into the grocery haul So for this week's grocery haul, I did Walmart grocery pickup just to save some time and also went to Trader Joe's because I wanted to check out all of the new fall stuff. Lots of good stuff in this week's grocery haul. First, I started with a big case of Gatorade Zero for Troy's lunches and an upside down 24 pack of Diet Coke for Troy. Paper plates because this has been our life during construction. He wants those pocket sandwiches again for lunches. So I'm this time I'm trying the Crescent Dough Sheets for him and I needed a restock on my favorite 93.7 grass fed ground beef from Walmart and a couple pounds of 96% extra lean ground beef as well. This is for a couple of dinner recipes. Piece. This is the ham for Troy's lunch little pockets. We're doing a Hawaiian pizza style this week. And then a big block of cheese. I'm making his macaroni salad for while I'm out of town. And some one third less fat cream cheese for a recipe. A restock on brown sugar because we are completely out and we're getting into baking season. Speaking of baking season, Trader Joe's has their vanilla bean paste back. This stuff is incredible. I also was completely out of soy sauce, so I did a quick restock from Trader Joe's and also crock pot liners. These are a game changer, makes cleanup so easy. Cubed ham for Troy's macaroni salad for a little bit of extra protein. A squirt bottle for Palmer when he jumps up on people. A cheese tray for his meat, cheese, and crackers. He's still on that kick, of course. And some Texas toast. This is for my breakfast meal prep. Stay tuned to see what I'm doing. And then, of course, we had to pick up another package of our favorite mini baguettes. We love these. And this is a new yogurt from Trader Joe's. I'm happy to see it's whole milk and it's apple caramel. I'm excited to give it a try. And I went ahead and grabbed two more of these room sprays from Walmart. They're 50 cents a piece. You can't beat it pumpkin pie coffee creamer. This one is really, really delicious. And then I did go ahead and grab another bag of the allulose sweetener. I'm still waiting on my Lakanto order just in case I didn't want to run out. Here's a new find from Trader Joe's. I think they had this last year. This is the maple and sea salt kettle corn. It is delicious. And then I needed masa for one recipe. So let me know down below any other recipes to use this masa. And of course, I can never go shopping without picking up dog treats. So I grabbed another one of these and the pumpkin dog treats are back at Trader Joe's. These are huge. I can break it up into pieces for all three dogs. I have been obsessed with this limoncello LaCroix. So I picked up another pack of that macaroni for Troy's pasta. I don't want to use my good fiber gourmet for that. I know it's ridiculous. Pineapple for his breakfast sandwiches, tomato sauce for a dinner recipe, and two huge cans of sliced olives for a recipe recipe and his sandwiches. And how cute is this? I just had to laugh at those olives on the fingers. Who else did that as a kid? Beans for my Sunday dinner. I needed both pinto and dark red kidney beans, a restock of eggs because we are just about out and fruits for the week. I made it simple raspberries and a papaya because I am heading out of town 
on Wednesday. So that is this week's grocery haul. I'm really excited about the recipes that I'm sharing. And now let's jump into what I'm doing for dinner and meal prep. So this is the week of 918 through 925. Today we are going out for dinner as always. Tomorrow, Sunday, which you will see in next Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day, I'm making Pioneer Woman Chili. Super excited for this. Monday and Tuesday are leftover nights to eat up all of that chili because Wednesday I'm actually heading out of town for five days to San Diego. So I didn't want to have a lot of leftovers in the refrigerator that could potentially go bad while I was gone. So this week's dinner plan looks a little bit different. Made a mistake here. This is actually breakfast overnight cinnamon roll French toast casserole. For lunch, I am doing sweet and sour chicken. And then for a snack, I'm making chocolate chip scones. I will be meal prepping even though I'm heading out of town to stay on track until I go. So that is this week's menu plan. Thank you for joining me on another WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good new food finds. So many great fall things out. Stay tuned for a huge all things fall video coming your way very shortly and the first fall video coming your way tomorrow. So make sure you're subscribed and your bell notification is turned on so you don't miss out. Don't forget to check out the description box for the two recipe eBooks, nutrition coaching, links, discounts to all my favorite things and my Facebook group. Head on over, join us. We'd love to have you. Happy Saturday friends and I'll see you in tomorrow's fall inspired video. Bye.